Hey, do you know you're supposed to be cleaning your refrigerator coils every six months? Come on, you don't have to lie to me. How could you know that? Five seconds ago, you just found out your refrigerator has coils. Now, what your condenser coils do is cool and condense the refrigerant, releasing heat so your fridge can keep its cool. Over time, these coils build up dirt, reducing your fridge's efficiency in preserving perishables, edging up your energy costs, and ultimately reducing the lifespan of your appliance. Now, six months is the minimum, but you really should be cleaning them every three for the best results. Don't sweat it. Once you wrap your head around how easy and quick this maintenance task is, you won't recoil at the thought of cleaning your coils. Trust me, if I can do it, you can do it. Follow these six steps. Step one, first, you gotta find them. Your refrigerator's coils are either gonna be located around front near the base covered by a panel or around back near the base, either exposed or covered by a panel like this fridge we're gonna show you today. Step two, move fridge, get out the way. If your coils are in back, you'll need to pull the fridge away from the wall in order to access them. This will be easy if your fridge has wheels, but if not, you may want to lift slightly and place furniture sliders underneath, then gently walk it out of its nook. Step three, pull the plug. Whenever you're doing maintenance on an electrical appliance, you should always unplug it. Minor though the risk may be, it's just not worth getting electrocuted. Step four, suck it up. Once you've accessed the coils in back of or underneath your fridge, use your vacuum cleaner with a flathead attachment or a brush attachment to suck up all that dirt dust and debris that's been building since the last time you did this, which, let's face it, is probably since you moved in or purchased the fridge. Step five, scrape and spray. In all likelihood, your negligence will have resulted in some stubborn spots that won't come off via suction. Use a stiff toothbrush or paintbrush to scrape the crud off these areas, and maybe use a can of compressed air to spray those tight nooks and crannies you can't quite reach. Step six, make a clean getaway. Before you plug the fridge back in and move it back into place, take this opportunity to vacuum and mop this hard to get to area that we've already established you don't get to as often as, well, at all. There, now that you know how to do that, the next time it's time to clean your condenser coils, you can do it at the same time you would normally clean your drip pan. You are cleaning your drip pan, right?